Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. It's already been a tremendous homestand for the home side, but they'll try to put the cherry on top tonight. Both these teams look ready to go, as does the official. Let's bring it on. The Jets take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Quebec's got the puck along the wall. And he takes the feed. Richard's got it along the boards. And a solid save there as we play on. And he came out and challenged a good save. Handles the pass. Quebec's gained possession along the boards. The Jets grab possession to the puck. Poked away yet centered by Richard. And now he tries to get it across to Connor. sitting next to those gentlemen in the penalty box. Drink a water, have a little chat, and catch your breath. Play set to resume here finally after a spirited scrap just moments ago. Winnipeg's won the draw. Babbage has got it along the wing. Quick feed to Eels. Sorry, James, that sounded big. I have to tell you, that was a large hit. Well, he's just slowly working his way to the bench, James, where the training staff's going to look at him. Had an awkward play earlier in the shift, and he doesn't look very good right now. He scores! We are tied! I like the way they've gone about this, James. They kept working away, not taking too many chances, and their work has resulted in a tie game. Man, now watch him play. He's just too powerful most times for the defender. He's an unstoppable force. He wants to lower his shoulder and drive the net. Yeah, good luck slowing that down. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. And a bad pass, and they'll be forced to start all over again outside the offensive Whoa. end. They're going to go. Yeah, he jumped in pretty quickly after his teammate got hurt. He wants to defend here. That had a whole lot of nasty, and it all seemed to be tilted in one way. Uh, pretty quickly, you could see there was an upper hand to be had in that fight. That's the way it played out. It looked even until it wasn't, and the road team gets a clear decision here. Well, with all that said and done with, we still got a game to play, and face-off here set to resume action. Quebec's won it. Taken by Housley. Passes it to Clark. There's a collision with some authority. Oh, the athletic therapist is already waiting for him at the door. He got crushed on that hit, and he needs some help. Quebec's got a hold of the puck. Slick feed. Puck grab by Murphy. Clark's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Quebec's got the puck against the boards. Scores! He buries it! Well, the game is level to this point. You get a chance, you finish it off. Now you can play from in front. You get down into that low slot, you don't have much time to deliver it. That puck's on and off the stick in a hurry and into the net. Quebec's effort pays off, and they take the one-goal lead. You can't even really relax. I mean, it's so much time left in the game. You've got the lead. That's great. Now go and get another one. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. 
Quebec's looking to break out. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Well, no use going to the box by yourself. You might as well drag someone else along and matching minors here for the two players. Love setting him up for a one-time blast. His 1T zone ability really makes him an offensive threat. Hellebuck's high compete level makes him solid in the crease. Those are two players I'm going to watch closely to see if one of them could be a difference maker for their team tonight, guys. Back to you. Quebec's on the attack. Winnipeg's got the puck. Poked away in the neutral zone by Morrissey. And he regains control of the puck. Directed over to Richard. Quebec's got it along the wall. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Quebec's got the puck along the boards. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Solani. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. On the attack along the boards. Fantastic save! Here's a short pass to Housley. Quebec's got a hold of it against the wall. He's in front! Oh, and he comes up with a stop! Here's a rip! Big time stop there! Oh, that's a hard save there. He's battling for position, battling for a sight line. He can't really see much through that screen, but he still makes the save. Denied by the goaltender. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Passes over to Niederreiter. Here they come. Quebec's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Connor. Quebec's got the puck along the wall. Slides it over with pace to Mahovlich. Tries to the crease. Hellebuck's gonna cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. Well, I guess would they call this rookie initiation here prior to puck drop tonight, Ray? I, I guess so, but what it really is is a way to have a little fun. The kid's nervous. He's gonna play his first NHL game, and everybody stops behind him. Everybody knows it's gonna happen. The rookie does too, but he gets a couple of spins on the ice by himself. Spotlight's on you, kiddo. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Moves it ahead from off the wall. Oh, he got... Yeah, after the teammate got hurt, he jumped right in. He's going to make him try and pay a price. We got ourselves a fight here. And good night. That looked like a mismatch at the start, too, James. It certainly played out that way. It's amazing how the energy in the building can seep away when your guy doesn't do so well in the fight. Yeah, you can hear a pin drop in this arena now. Well, this game has new life breathed into this building tonight after what we just saw moments ago, but we still got a game to play. And now it's grabbed by Murphy. Denies him on the play. The Jets have it now. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. Looks like offsetting penalties have been called here, and each team will lose a player. Howard Chuck's absence will continue for the rest of the evening. He's just been ruled out by the training staff. Thanks, Ray. We'll see how this impacts the game now going forward. Quebec's got possession here in their own end. Clark's moving the puck through his own zone. Look out, here they come on the attack. Puck scooped up by Morrissey. And he slides it quickly to Connor. 
Oh, a big collision there. James, he had the homing device on there. He saw the chance and lowered the boom. Mahabalich has got it against the boards. Tremendous stop by Hellebuck. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Slides it across to Mahabalich. And a strong physical collision on the play there. Olchek's got it in the defensive end. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Good stand-up hit. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Connor. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around. Return to the game. Just got word from the PR department. He's out for the night. All right, thanks very much for the update, Mr. Ferraro. And we'll see how things are impacted here with the line juggling going forward. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Stones him in front. Not many times you get a clean look at the shot, so the goalies are always looking around this screen, trying to find it to make the save. Passes the puck over to Ovechkin. Cutting to the front of the net. He scores! That's three, Ray! Yeah, just they haven't taken their foot off the gas pedal at all. So once they got that first one, they kept pushing away. Now they've got three. As this play heads towards the net, you can see the traffic. The goalie's struggling to find the puck line, so he'll drop into position in the butterfly. Thinks he's got it covered. But there's a crack, there's a hole, and it's in the net. Lots of time left in this period. Quebec's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. The Jets win the draw here in the neutral zone. Oh, what's the word I'm looking for in that thesaurus? Oh, you got it. Truculent? Yeah, I know you were ready to fire that up. That is a big hit. And I knew you were digging for that one. Well, after that hit, he's slowly working his way to the bench. He is not feeling very good. He's got a step. He's stopped. Quick check of the shoulder to make sure that he's in clear and then it's focus on the net. A nice fake, a nice move, a nice shot. And it's in the back of the cage. Quebec's on cruise control now. Is that fair to say? It is, and it looks like they're going to try and get another couple of goals here. They're not letting down at all. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Feeds it over to Kadri. Moves it to Housley. And a little body contact on that play. He's down on the ice. Their trainer is already standing on top of the boards. It looks like he's going to come over and help him as soon as they blow this dead. Oh, it looked like he took a big hit there. Let's get another look at that. I, I think he's shaken up. Housley's left the bench and aided by one of the training staff. He's gone down the tunnel towards the locker room. Looks like it's some kind of head injury. We'll see if we can try to get an update as soon as possible here as this game goes on. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Sends a pass over. Moves it around along the half wall. The Jets will take it behind the net. Looks to set up at the point now. Moves the puck down low. He's never scored, but watching him wind through the offensive zone, he looks like he's got plenty of confidence. They're going to have to look at him immediately. He's just slowly working his way to the bench, James. Winnipeg's got it behind the net. There's a hit, and he's trying to 
leave everything out there on the ice tonight. Winnipeg's got the puck in their own end. Now a quick pass to Shifley. Couldn't make the connection on the play. And some textbook body contact there. Quebec's gained possession along the boards. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. He took a pretty solid jolt there, James. Uh, we're going to have to check in on him in a second. Richard's injury has kept him out of the game. I just got word, James, he's not coming back this evening. Thanks for that, Ray. Let's see how the coach rolls with that now. Gets it over to Solani. Some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. And that's just out of reach. Oh, we'll get some tired defenders as icing is the call. Shifley's plate is getting a little fuller by the moment here. As the captain of this team, he's got to be the one to rally them. He's got to be the one to show them a way out of this mess they're in. Can't make the play, and the puck leaves the zone. We oh, have a boy coming up here on the play. You can't do that to the Stars. Yeah, even if you think it's a clean hit, and I do, it doesn't matter. Somebody's coming after you. The crushing blow to finish it. Uh, sometimes you're just too big or too strong for the guy you line up against, and that one ended like it should have. They'll untangle. That's the end of the fight. That's also the end of the night. You fight, you're gone. See you later, boys. Yeah, a little throwdown, a little showdown, and they piece themselves out of this one. Shifley's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Pass broken up. Inside the offensive end, now down the left. Grips it, rips it, and that's blocked from someone in front. Quebec's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. And he slides it quickly to Connor. Long wow. side save. Gonna hear it from the crowd for the rest of the night. He caused that er earlier injury to the home team player, and they're not very happy with it. And a good solid hit on that play. Mahomlich is certainly not at 100%. He's just trying to get through the rest of this shift and get back to the bench. Tosses it to Dylan. Quebec's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. With possession along the wall. Sends the pass in front. Puck moves over to Solani. Moves inside. He scores. Now the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely, and they're able to capitalize on the extra man. Winnipeg still trailing in this one, but it's a little bit closer now. A little bit better, and now maybe you can find some energy because there's lots of room to claw back into this game. Is dropped and we are back underway. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Along the half wall, well, the puck. handles the puck. Well, that's the end of his shift. Man, James, he took a huge hit. Slowly getting himself to the bench where he can get tended to by the trainer. Lundqvist's gonna cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Curry's still trying to shake off the effects of this hit. He really took a thump there. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. The Jets win it. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Oh, what a stop! Howsley's changed his focus here, James. It looks like he's finished fighting, and now he's going to play the game. Takes it to the front, and keeps it out with the toe. Wow, what a play on his part. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. Lundqvist's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. 
Shanahan's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. They take possession as he locks them up off the face-off. Ovechkin swooping in on the attack. Hammers a shot! Hellebuck's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Oh, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Shifley's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. In all alone on the breakaway. Oh, just gets him. They score! The special on special teams tonight. Well, the extra work they've done, the way that they've moved some people around, has helped them cash in more than once on the power play. Winnipeg's got new life here in this second period, Ray. It's amazing what a goal does. The energy on the bench changes. Guys can't wait to get on for their next shot. And he takes the dish. Oh, that's a rattler. Did you hear those boards rattle? Connects with a long lead pass here in the middle. Backhander. Oh, and it's just wide of the net. No play on. He's going to shake his head when he sees this because he's, he's in as good a scoring spot as you're going to get to all night. And he just misses the net. Sends a pass in front. Brings it off the poles. And now he moves it to Babbage. There's a firm collision. Quebec's got the puck. Takes it into the slot. Oh, blocked down by Hellebuck. The Jets are in transition. Quebec's penalty killers get a hold of it. Look at that hit. Let's get physical. Looks a little uncomfortable like he's banged up a bit, James, but not going to the bench. Going to try and finish this shift. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Carlson's got it in the offensive end. The backhander. Oh, and it stays out with the toe save. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Takes the feed from the goaltender. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Makes a move in front. Oh, what a save with the stick by Hillebuck. He bails his guys out again. I mean, he probably could use a little help. The guy's standing right in the middle of the ice to shoot this puck, but he tracks it and makes a really good save. And that pass doesn't go. He got robbed again. He's got to get his head up here. They're going to be carting him off the ice. Can't make the connection on the pass. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. And that one stopped. Here's a feed in front. And that Karen's off a twig in front of the net. The Jets scoop it up along the boards. Getting a little physical there with that collision. Dome's time is almost done. Nice feed. Quebec's finally back to even strength and not a moment too soon after hemorrhaging goals there. Well, that penalty killing group just got run over by the power play. Multiple goals scored on that five-minute major. And that skips out of the offensive end. Second intermission approaching quickly here. And now he moves it quickly to Kadri. The Jets take possession in the defensive end. And he lowers the boom there. Well, this has been a fun one here tonight. Great energy here in the building as well. We'll get a fresh sheet of ice and come back with period number three in moments. will continue for the rest of the evening. He's just been ruled out by the training staff. Thanks, Ray. We'll see how this impacts the game now going forward. It's been quite the night of fireworks thus far. Let's see what this third period can do to keep up. 
Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? The Jets' puck possession game has been non-existent tonight. They're Here we go. Yeah, your star player gets hit like that. Somebody's better step up for him. And he challenges them, and now they're going to go. Down he goes, fairly one side, would you say? Yeah, I've been on the other side of that one side, and you're happy when it goes down to the ice because you know help is on the way. Story of my life in elementary school, Ray. Not much to be said from the home team here. Their bench kind of quietly sits back down after their guy comes on the losing end of this bout. Yeah, the air from this building seems to have just deflated in here. Well, this crowd's still in a bit of a frenzy after what we just witnessed moments ago. Both teams lining up for the faceoff. The Jets play it along the boards. They put the puck into the offensive end. Quick pass to Nylander. Quebec's got the puck against the boards. Slides it back to the blue line. He scores! Good position to get towards the net where you can deflect the puck. So as we see on the replay, that's excellent positioning and good eye hand to deflect the puck past the goal. Quebec's still a long way to the end of this one, but they're up by two. How does that change things? Well, it gives you more cushion, of course. You can do math. Sometimes. Yeah, but they don't really have to change too much here. I think they just continue to play in the style they are. And that's broken up. Possession along the wall. Puck picked up by Mahalich. They go on the attack from the left side. What a hit, and that'll wear down the opposition. Quebec's earned their place at the top of the league with an outstanding season. From the goaltender to the way they've scored, they're determined to stay on top. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Quebec's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Here's an odd man rush. It's a two-on-one. Quebec's got it in their own zone. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Right through, center it into the offensive zone. Oh, did he eat that hit. This is a good time to be retired. Goes right to the crease. Makes his presence known on the ice. Here he is, wrists on net. And he shut the door on that last play. Shooters try to make it more difficult for the goalies by getting traffic in front of the net. He had to find it, and he did to make that save. Made the save on the play. Lundquist getting bailed out by his team tonight. He's not had a good night. His save percentage is poor. Jokinen's moving it ahead. Oh, devastating hit on the play. Sometimes, James, you think you got more time than you do. There was no room left. That looked painful. The Jets move the puck in the defensive zone. And he takes the feed. Look at that hit. Maybe try to wear down the opponents here. Quebec's in transition. Oh, I love all these goals, James. I mean, you're racking up the goal calls like crazy, which means post-game dinner is going to be a lot quieter. I love it. Kadri's got the puck. The Jets have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Shifley. Great hit on the play. He scores! You're down by a puck. You want to give yourself the opportunity for a tie goal. They've done that with this one here. Winnipeg's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Boom! Oh! And sometimes you just can't get out of the way, but for him, it's been all night. He's been on the receiving end of these types of hits. Here's a short pass to Shifley. Gets a glove on it to make the save. And the pass is picked off. 47 seconds to go here. Made that stop. Tremendous intensity here in the offensive zone. Denied by Hellebuck. Moves it quickly over to Schwabley. Wow. 
And now he angles it across to Ovechkin. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Ovechkin. Can't make it work. Looks to get the puck over to Shifley. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kadri. Made the stop on the play. Scooped up along the wall by Shifley. With the backhander! And he scores! Oh, he'd like to tell you that he aimed that shot. Yeah, really? That thing's on his stick and off his stick in a hurry. You're just trying to get it over top of the goalie. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Hellebuck's at the bench alone for the extra attacker to jump on. And that brings an end to this one here this evening. The Jets see their winning ways finally come to an end, but they still played pretty well, I thought. I don't know really what else they could do tonight. I thought they played a pretty good hockey game as well, James. They just didn't get any result for it at the end. But you win a lot in the road, eventually you're going to lose. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.